We made it. <laughs> it's 7.35, but we made it. There was nothing stopping us from getting to Epcot tonight. Not even a insane, insane, insane work day again. Guys, <laughs> I'm sick of it. We're eating at the festival tonight, so not a good thing that literally right as we hit the festival center here, both of us are like, oh, we're like legitimately hungry. This is the issue, is that we've been having these little stays and with the holidays, we haven't gone like actual grocery shopping and then it's like, we have a staycation this weekend, so why are we going to go grocery shopping? So we had peanut butter and jelly an hour and a half ago. <laughs> so, we're we gotta get eat. this and charcuterie. And fish and chips. I gotta show you guys two things. One, we got the cup holder made for our stroller. It is so nice, clips right on, and holds it so snug. And then I got this loopy case, which is like very on brand for me this year with the white and black buffalo plaid. And then I got the black little loopy. One of you guys sent me this on Instagram and said that it reminded you of me. And I really, really needed a case. And it is perfect. Is it weird to see my screen and it not be Correct. Sarah is on FaceTime with Christina and about to go show Christina and Luca Olaf. We're gonna show you Olaf on the way out in better viewing than the last time we were here. But Sarah set me up to get the blackened salmon, which looks divinity. How am I not gonna come back when I'm hungry with a $2 cookie? So this is festival favorites. Here is blackened salmon and grits and some okra with some stew. And then look at this just classic gingerbread cookie. Not the gum drop buns. Genji, who ate your arm? If you know what that's from, put it in the comments below. It's really good, it's soft. Peter already ate one of the gum drop buttons. The stew and grits and salmon? Yeah. About to go get my own. Wait, I think it's bass. Nice way is, yeah. <laughs> I don't know fish. Fish don't know you. They don't. I've never been fishing once in my life. I oh, have. Yeah. But I, do, I went once. Oh yeah, with, with my Deep friend John. Fishing, like yeah, we went fishing. Yeah, we went fishing. Yeah, we're looking for sharks. You know what? I really don't we like recreational fishing. I'm sorry because I know that's like people's jam, but I just like I really don't like to catch it and then throwing it back like that. Jam, like it's a peanut butter and jam sandwich. Well, this is the cutest little charcuterie plate I ever did see. How much was this? Six fifty. All right, there's charcut. Two thumbs up, but I can only put up one thumb because my other thumb is holding this camera. We're gonna check out the merch and we're gonna go get some fish and chips. Did you show the hidden figments? Sarah thinks these are hidden figments. It looks like it. Because there's minis in the other one. Oh, maybe there is. Oh, you didn't tell me there was minis in the other one. Is it? Is it a scandal? Who knows? Or do I just want it to be? I think you just want it to be, kind of. Where are these minis? Watch these not be real minis. Or did your eyes play trick oh. on you? Um, that's not a hidden no. mini. That's just geometry. That's too... That's geometry. That's too much of a coincidence. I don't know about that. <laughs> Wait, look at, the, look at the wall. That's a hidden mini. Get it? I've had these ears forever. And they got all the cute merch in here. Stinking cute. I haven't seen this cute little sweatshirt. The sleeves are a different material. I love that. It does have this on the back. It's cute, but I just wish that it was like this subtle, just Mickey. Oh my gosh. That is so cute. This is me and even here. <clears throat> Last time we didn't get a good shot of the Olaf. And here he is. Haha, <laughs> tonight's the day. Tonight's the night that Peter fooled a hungry Sarah. I told her to go snag a table over there because there's seats and everything. What am I doing? I'm not gonna grab one fish and chips. I'm grabbing two fish and chips. No sharing tonight. And I might just get a Coke even. He comes bringing gifts. I did not think we were getting our own. <laughs> I think in honor we should also turn around and get that after we're done eating. 
Oh. Eat my friends, fish and chips. <laughs> this is our first time having them since we were plant based. And if you know us before that, these were our favorite we quick were fish service and chips aficionados. meal. So we gotta get our own. Those were so tasty. However, I could only eat one because I just got a little creeped out. Like that was like my first like we just ate that little bit of fish, but like we've only eaten like small little portions. But that was a honking piece of fish, and my first one was so thick. What the heck? Whoa. So harmonious is happening, illuminations is not returning. Oh. <laughs> One of the wow. barges is out already. Yeah. I don't know if you can tell on the camera. You can tell. Yeah, that's it's one much of the bigger barges. in person. Yeah, it's huge. Everyone was hating it online, but that's what happens with the internet. People are haters. But I'm excited that at least during the daytime, that there are going to be water fountains. Yeah. I think it's, it's exciting different. because, like, before with Illuminations, everything was backstage. And then it came out right before showtime. Mm -hmm. This stuff is staying, but it's going to be water fixtures. Yeah. Everything on this menu I want. Everything sounds so good, but the whole entire menu is different. Pomegranate though. chili crispy cauliflower. Sounds divine. With a red pepper Aleppo sauce. Yeah, and another grape leaves. Grape leaves? I love grape leaves. Honestly, Sarah, let's Ooh, add this up. Ooh, and tea. And for your birthday, let's come here and say <laughs> one of everything. Oh my gosh. We miss our favorite water. And the quick service. And the people. I did the math and it'd be about $96 pre-tax and tip to get one of everything. Hey. We're doing it. Should I do the other lens on the zoom zoom it, but just so gorgeous with that that tree across the lagoon. I say it all the time, but the, the World Showcase tree is my favorite tree in all the resorts and parks. Do you agree, disagree, or are you uncertain? I'm uncertain. Doesn't Sarah just look gorgeous tonight with the, wow. her flowing hair and her cute top and her, her ears? We said that Epcot really doesn't feel like Christmas without the storytellers. Yeah. Or without candlelight processional. Yeah. We, we were saying like we've been so busy like we've just, it just hit us. It just dawned on us that Christmas is so close but it's still missing. Because like other years you see the decorations I feel before you see some of those daytime activities. Yeah. So I just feel I like mean, we're in that weird limbo. Then it hit me and I was like, oh Christmas is really soon. Yeah. We're not really in that we limbo. We really haven't been here during the day though. And we are hopefully this weekend so maybe Help that'll... Me. Do we have a park pass for this park? Sick. James, these are the Germany trains. I almost said I can't wait for him to be old enough to enjoy these as a bigger kid, but this is still special. Yes. And so we gotta soak in every minute we have with him. We gotta point out all the different buildings and yeah. who lives there. Yeah. Mr. Crumpet? Right. Mrs. No, Grinch. can't wait. Every minute. Soak it in. Oh my goodness, oh my goodness. Pretzel dance! We were walking past Germany Pavilion and Castle Marquette was like, Do you want some pretzels? And we yes. must look like we like a good pretzel. <laughs> Here you go. Festival items. Got our own fish and chips and then these. I still have like my whole thing. Korea appreciation. Up on the top there, there's an angel. She's holding the world. It's like the showcase of the world and it's the world showcase. I think it's kind of funny. It's like an inside joke. An world inside joke with you and the angel. And the world showcase with you. Thank you for celebrating with us. No, thank you. Guess what time it is, everybody? We're home from the theme park world. It's 2 10 in the morning. I've been working on a project. I like fixing an issue with a program that we use at work. Um, needless to say, it's a program that my boss developed many moons ago that I was able to log in through this macro and it's running the process now. My friends and accountant will be happy in the morning. I need to go to bed. Sarah, even James have been asleep this whole time. All right. 
December 15th is the day. The speaker of our daily message is Voltaire. Life is a shipwreck, but we must not forget to sing in the lifeboats. Do I look delirious in front of my produce? Epcot really turned my day around with how crazy my day has been. I really hope I can get everything together for me not have to do any work while we're at our little staycation this weekend, but it's weird because my boss is out still. And then if I'm out, I just need to make sure my team has all the tools that they need to get the job done, hopefully without me being called. It's good to be home. What should we eat for lunch? What? What should we eat? What do you think? Oh, so sweet. We know what our goals are, we know what we hope to accomplish, and believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions.